Ahmet Altan, Turkish journalist, best-selling novelist. For those unfamiliar with Turkey, he is a Turkish combination of Seymour Hersh and Dan Brown, a free thinker. Gazetecilik hayatla uğraşan bir meslek. Romancılık daha ziyade ölümle uğraşan bir iş. Following family tradition, Altan came to be known as an incisive political writer who opposed all forms of oppression throughout his career. Like his father, Çetin Altan, and brother, Professor Mehmet Altan, he has always been a staunch supporter of democracy and freedom of speech. When Turkey tried to liberate itself from the tight grip of military and civil domination, Altan was at the forefront of the campaign serving as the executive editor of his Taraf newspaper. Do not be afraid, he said, when he saw the country once again turning towards despotism under the Erdogan regime. He derided pressure coming from above, encouraging his colleagues to speak up. Even your smile would scare them out of their wits. The government emerged as the greatest beneficiary of the failed coup on July 15, 2016. Thanks to the state of emergency, the Turkish regime has been jailing everyone that does not comply with the new status quo. While muzzling all critical voices, the government finally silenced Ahmet Altan. He was detained, along with his brother, for nothing more than their reputations as dissidents. The charge against them is giving subliminal messages on a TV show. Sizi eleştireceğiz. Sizden korkmuyoruz. Ne yaparsanız yapın. Siz hukukun dışına çıktığınız sürece biz sizi eleştireceğiz. Since September 10th, 2016, Altan has been behind bars. His crime? Standing up for free speech. <gülüyor>